Hi everyone, today I'm going to be going through some terminology related to Albert Bandura, social learning theory, and the Bobo doll experiment. Social learning theory is Bandura's theory that people learn by observing others, especially when those behaviors are reinforced. Learning happens through modeling, not just direct experience. Observational learning is learning that occurs by watching others' behaviors and their outcomes. This includes four steps, attention, retention, reproduction, and motivation. Vicarious reinforcement is learning by watching someone else get rewarded for a behavior. It increases the likelihood the observer will imitate that same behavior. On the other hand, vicarious punishment is learning not to do something by seeing someone else punished for it. This helps shape behavior without direct consequences. Reciprocal determinism is the idea that behavior, personal factors like thoughts, and the environment all influence each other in a loop. You shape your world and it shapes you back. Self-efficacy is the belief in your own ability to succeed at a task. The higher the self-efficacy, the more motivation, persistence, and resilience. Attention, in the context of modeling, is the first step in observational learning. You have to notice the behavior in order to learn it. Things like novelty or status can increase attention. Retention is the second step in modeling. You must remember what was observed in order to later imitate it. Mental imagery and language can really help here. Reproduction is the third step. This is being able to physically and mentally perform the behavior you observed. Practice helps here. And motivation is the fourth step in observational learning. You need a reason to imitate the behavior usually some form of expected reward or benefit. The famous Bobo doll experiment was Bandura's study where children who saw adults act aggressively toward a doll were more likely to do the same. This proved that aggression can be learned through observation. Moral disengagement is a process where individuals justify harmful behavior by detaching from ethical standards. It helps explain how people rationalize aggression or cruelty. I hope you found this quick walkthrough helpful. Please hit the like button if you did. Do me a huge favor and let me know in the comments how your study journey is going. That'll really boost me in the algorithm. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell button so that you'll be notified when new free study content comes out just like this. I wish you all the best of luck on your journey towards becoming a therapist.